In this tutorial, we will show you the new features that Microsoft Office Project 2013 offers. When you open Project 2013, you go directly to the dashboard. Through this dashboard, you can access not only all the local templates, but search for online e-templates as well using the search bar. In this video, we have selected Software Development Plan Template. Once you have clicked on it, a small box will open and it will start downloading. Once it has been downloaded, open it. Next, go to the File tab, which is also known as the Backstage View. Go to the Account tab and sign in using your Hotmail account. Once you have signed in, you can add services by clicking on the Add a Service button. When the drop-down menu appears, three options will be displayed to you. Add images and videos, store your documents through Office 365 SharePoint or SkyDrive, or share your documents on social websites such as Facebook, LinkedIn, and Twitter. The new feature added to Project is the Timeline View, which helps you visualize your project in order to deliver presentations. The chart above, when clicked, shows you three buttons. The bottommost button is used to filter out things which you do not want in the chart. You can easily add or remove categories from there. The middle button allows you to choose various designs, while the topmost button deals with the chart elements. Go to the Project tab and click on the Apps for Office button. A small box will open and through that box you will be able to search for different apps which are available for Office Project. To share your project, go to the Backstage view and click on the Share tab. You can either save and sync via SharePoint or share it through email. In this video we have saved it on our SkyDrive. Click on the Go to Save As button and then click on the Browse icon. Once the Save As box appears, Click on the Save button and your document will be saved on your SkyDrive.